Hello there guys, Danny Baby here with Danny Baby TV. And today I am doing another tutorial and I am going to be showing you how to decrease the size of your videos but still um, keep the quality. Keep the quality just as good. So what you want to do is you just want to go into your browser I'm using Internet Explorer. Then go to handbrake.fr, I think it is. Um, yeah, this is the website, handbrake.fr, and then click this one, Windows XP or the other platforms. Yeah, you can, I think you can get this on Mac, I'm not sure, but download this one. And um, once you've downloaded it, open it up. I've just got it. Hang on. I've got it here, okay. So it'll open and it'll look like this. And you know, you open this and you go, "Wow, this looks complicated." But by following this tutorial, you'll be able to figure it out. So the first thing that you want to do is you want to find your video that you're going to use. I'm going to use a little snippet of a video from the Mighty Quest for Epic Loot. Let me just um, find the one, find what I am looking for. Mighty, click open. I'm just using a little snippet from the. Um, from the trailer thing, so I have that here. It tells you the length of it, and so on. What you want to do now is you want to choose your name of it. So I normally just save it in the same place, give it the same name. So might mighty, and then I normally put comp so that I know it's the compressed version for when I'm uploading this to YouTube or whatever I'm doing with it. Do that. And then what you want to do is you want to fiddle with some of these settings. So I have this setting here called DBTV. And I would just like um, use the settings that I'm going to show you. So what you want to do is you want to click the web optimize. Okay. This will tell you the size of your source video. Just keep it the same. Um, and then that should be fine. Web optimize on video filters. That's what it should look like. Everything should be off. On video, you want um, H.264, frame rate same as source, constant frame rate. And then over here, you want quality. Click the button here which says constant quality. And then change this to 28. I find that this gives the quality just as good, maybe a, a, like the smallest, smallest bit smaller. I'll do a comparison of these two pieces of video at the end, but um, that 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 just put that slide that along to 28. On audio, you just want to leave that here yeah, on subtitles. Leave that unless you want to add subtitles, but that's probably do dodgy. Chapters you don't need. Advanced don't need that either. So basically, the only things that you need to change are these, are video and picture. So that's the only thing that you need to sort out and do web optimize. So what you can do then is if you click the start button, it's just going to export itself out here. It shows you along the bottom the progress. If you minimize it, it keeps working in your background and it just gets minimized to the systems tray, which you can double click on and open it. As it shows you, it shows you the percentage of how much it's done. Obviously, the bigger the um, video file in the first place, the longer the video, the more time that this bit here will take. And it tells you the estimated time remaining. So um, I'm just going to um, jump ahead to, one, to when it's finished. So uh, stay tuned. Right, guys. So that's just about finished. It's got like point something of a percent that it's finished. That took about a minute altogether. Um, so it it does take more time than the video, but it has to go through each and every frame. So I hope that you should understand that. Let me just open up this. I now have the video, and um, I have the two videos actually. You can't see what I'm looking at, but there, look, mighty and mighty comp. That first one was six point five two megabytes. This one is three point one. The quality is just as good. So what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to um, flick into a bit of a what's the word? Um, a preview of what the difference is in the quality, and then I'll end off the tutorial. So 
So guys, I hope that you can see what the um like what the quality is of the of the um of uh, of that. And it, there is there is a slight slight quality drop, but it gives you much smaller files and when uploading to YouTube, especially for me when I have the worst internet in the world, that can help so much. So guys, um I hope you've enjoyed this um quick tutorial if you did then a like is appreciated if you really enjoyed it then give us a favor and remember to subscribe for more gaming tutorials and vlogs so thanks for watching